make it better I will try to make it good I will make sure that my message Will be well understood And a feeling my heart is pounding As I'm breathing in the air And it begins to make all sense now I can feel it everywhere The resolution The resolution Resolution of the Resolution of the Try to make it better Try to make it good Try to make it better Try Right on. That was As Crows Fly called Resolution. And what a great tune. I really, really enjoy it. Like, really, um, I could say, like, um, a mix of 70s uh, rock and almost like nice alternative, but the vocals were really cool. Like, really enjoyed it. Yeah, definitely. I, I always felt that that particular track, the guitar riff, had a little bit of Aussie going on, like Randy Rhodes era Aussie solo stuff, you know? Right. Uh, had that kind of, or even Jakey Lee, that kind of era. Um, yeah, but it, yeah, it was, it was, it was um, yeah, it's a really, really rocking tune. Like I say, he's a great guy, and they're from Melbourne in Australia, so he's actually uh, come online within the last kind of half hour or so and said, "Oh, just seen that you're playing that tune. Thanks very much." So it's kind of, uh, it's kind of cool the way that we seem to work the time of the show. We kind of hit all parts of the world, <laughs> which is quite cool. Um, so hopefully he's tuning in. But yeah, uh, they're a really cool band. I think they've been together about uh, three years. I think he said. Uh, there's just the three of them, and they're basically um, getting out there and, and you know gigging and stuff. And they've just released this uh, literally in the last couple of weeks, so it's brand new for New Music Saturday. So yeah, man, I'm absolutely loving it. Want to hear more? Oh man, I I I'm, I'm like I was shocked. I'm just like 387 views, man. Like part of my language, but holy fuck! <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty insane, man. That's really cool. <laughs> <laughs> Mind you, having said that, I'm not surprised because it's great, you know. So, no, well, no, 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 I know, not, not, not to toot our own horn, but, <laughs> but well, I just, I just, it just, it's still, it's, it's very cool, and I'm, I'm so grateful and so thankful. I mean, that, 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 that made people watch. I know it's kind of more like headshots as, as opposed to like at least uh, from waist up, but uh, I did the best I could with the space I was provided with the phone exactly, right? So. You know, I did. I did what I could to get everybody involved, and you know, I know you could hear me, and I kind of popped my head in a few times, and at one point, I actually held my 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 puppy up, Rini, so I could, so everybody yeah, could so see, I, yeah. so everybody <laughs> could see her. But uh, I, I did what I could. That's the only problem is just the area uh, that I'm in. It's kind of hard sometimes to get a, a phone set up properly or the right area to kind of get everybody else. But at least you could see the boy. You could see that you could see their faces, so you could see who Jagger, Ryan, and Warren actually were. So it wasn't just the the top of their heads or the come midway through. But we we made it work. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I think that's the cool thing about live videos. Is you know, but I don't think people are necessarily expecting it to you know to be a feature film quality. And you know, well, well I am, <laughs> but you know, <laughs> obviously, yeah, obviously we have high expectations. <laughs> A bit, a bit, a bit. It's just interesting yeah. to see the people that you hear, isn't it? So it's, it's engaging, and that's why people yeah. are watching it. And you know, I've, I've shared it in a few groups and stuff, and people will no doubt keep watching that because yeah, of, right. because they're in different time zones, and because the way that you know social media generally works, and it'll you know put things in people's feeds at different times and stuff. We'll, we'll kind of see that. Right. Group. So yeah. it's, it's it's really cool to see, man. And hopefully, it gets the band um, a bit more exposure and a bit more support, and hopefully, the show as well. So yeah, it's well, cool. It's worked out really well. I, I have put them on live before when they, they're actually the last show they went to at the uh, Oldies Bar and Grill. I put them on for a few minutes on my Facebook Live. So, but yeah, they 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 are, they really are great live. So let's get to our next song and another kick-ass cool band from the UK. This one band's called Code Ascending. 
And this is, of course, again, courtesy of Brother Mike. And here we go with Codescending and Children. Dig this. Right on, that was Coda Sending with Children. Now, that was a haunting, kind of creepy sort too, but really cool. These guys have got great lyrics and great uh, harmony when it comes to that kind of sort of thing. You know, they're they're like, uh, um, uh, whoa, what's their name there? I can't remember their name right now, but I'll think of it in a second. But either way, I uh, love Coda Sending and, and just how the new EP kind of sprung up, uh, sprung upon us both without realizing, like, what, really? New EP? Awesome. We're all over it. <laughs> Yeah, no, I love that. That was a good day, actually. It was a very good day when that just appeared. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's a great tune. It's a, it's a fantastic EP. They're a really, really shit-hot live band. Um, and, and I've said before, we were lucky enough to play with them. They really were awesome. Um, and they're, they're genuinely cool guys as well. So I think that's a brilliant tune. Um, funnily enough, earlier this evening, um, uh, me, me and my wife were sitting down. There's nothing on the telly. And we put on Stop Making Sense by Talking Heads, which is... If, if, if anyone listening to this is in a band and you play live, you need to go and watch that DVD and that's how you play a live show. And anything below that is under par. <laughs> um, it's, it's absolutely awesome. But um, actually listening to these guys tonight in the context of having watched that this evening, it occurred to me that that's what's been bugging me about Cody Sending, his voice. I keep saying, oh, they're a bit like The Cure and other bands. 
his voice is actually really, really like, um, uh, oh, I forgot his name now. Robert um, Smith? Uh, uh, the Talking Heads. Oh, guy. oh. <laughs> uh, it's gone. Um, anyway, uh, but yeah, it's, he's got that kind of thing in his voice, um, which which is awesome as well. And, uh, you know, again, having seen them live, they're, they're akin to that in terms of uh, how they create a presence on stage, which is amazing. So, yeah, really, really cool band. Um, I'm going to go David Byrne, not Pete. That was it. David oh, Byrne. Oh, there you go, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was thinking of Pete Burns, I think. I don't know. Uh, anyway, um, we're completely off topic there. We love Code Ascending. It's a brilliant tune. Go and get the EP because it's fantastic. <laughs> right on. So, next up, we have uh, this is courtesy of uh, MS Cotton Plugin Baby. This band is called Ghost of Social Networks, and the song is called Outside the Wheel. Dig this. Oh! 